is by Hamilton. It's called the Delaware. Delaware. And I want to say I saw this one online. Not really sure. I'll let you know when we get on the inside. But um, again, it's a four bedroom, two bath. Measurements are 32 by 68. Let's take a look, see. Okay. Whew. Beautiful. This is the living room. I'm gonna come around and it's such a big living room. Took me a while to walk over here. So that's the door where I came in. Let me get out of the get in better lighting. All right. This is the living room, you guys. Huge living room, tray ceiling, ceiling fan. Very nice. Huge living room. See how big it is? Beautiful. Got your cutout so you can take your shoes off when you walk in the door. And walking in, this is the view that you see into the kitchen and the dining room. Really nice. Beautiful. All right, so let's go into the, this is the dining room. Here, you've got sliding doors, got your ceiling fan, excuse me, not a ceiling fan, a chandelier. Love the galvanized uh, chandelier there. I don't know if I like that bottom part with it, but I would do the top because it's, like galvanized and it's farmhousey. Very nice. So that's the dining room. Beautiful. Now this one has a family room and it has the barn doors. I, I say it in every video. That's optional. So if you don't want those, you don't have to get them. You don't have to. You can get double doors. No doors. It's really up to you. But for you farmhouse lovers, and excuse the paint, they're putting this one, these houses come and go so fast on this lot that they're always in a state of putting together or taking apart. That's the dining room. Here's the kitchen. Love the kitchen. You got black appliances, industrial sink, two huge windows over the sink. You also have a small prep sink in the island. This is a U-shaped sink. But this bar, this countertop, this island is huge. You could put three or four bar stools here, you guys. I don't know if the camera's doing it any justice, just how big this island is. Love the prep station here. So you can, you have cabinets here where your pots and pans go and you can stand here and wash your veggies and chop them up while you're talking to your guests. Really nice. Really, really nice. Love this U shape. Gives you so much extra storage. Love it. That's open shelving and then the, you have doors and you'll have drawers there. Really nice. I love the light countertops. I love the backsplash. Gives it a, a farmhousey feel. It's kind of like a wood. Really nice. Tall cabinets that go all the way to the ceiling. You got a built-in microwave, ceramic top stove. Lots of cabinet space here. Lots of cabinet space. I'll go back around and give you another look. I love the pendant lighting. It goes with the Dining room lighting, that galvanized look. Real nice farmhouse feel in here for my farmhouse lovers. Really nice. Beautiful. Let's look at the laundry room here. All right, that's your back door. Huge laundry room. Your washer and dryer goes there. And then you have all the space over here for pantry stuff, for 
for a deep freezer, for storage, for whatever you like. This is huge. This is a, oh, that's your AC unit. Breaker box is there. Really nice. So that's just one section of the laundry room. Okay. And here's the other. There's a back door. And this door here closes. So if you got a mess back here, you're doing laundry, and you got company, you could close that off, you guys. Really nice. All right. Let's take a look at this bonus room. So give you another clear picture. Here's your living room. Kitchen dining room and then through these doors you have a great room family room what have you it has a fireplace space for your tv up top there's no carpet in here got the same flooring as the kitchen and dining room huge space love it bright lighting you got a ceiling fan in this room. Great family room. So you're in the kitchen and you can keep an eye on the kids or your guests from every angle. Let's open these up. That one won't open, but that one did. So you can have those open and be accessible everywhere. All right, so before we go down that long hall, let's see what's here. All right, you have guest bedroom number one. Wonderful. So this is guest bedroom number one. There's the closet. And here's a nice surprise. This guest bedroom attaches to the bathroom. The, so you have a bathroom here Got a sink, makeup area, toilet, cabinetry, tub and shower combo there. And then you walk right through that bedroom, bathroom, into the other guest bedroom. Really nice. So this is guest bedroom number two. There's the closet. And these two bedrooms share that bathroom. Awesome. Give you a look from here. You got your guest bedrooms on either side and a bathroom there. Perfect. Now down this hall, you got guest bedroom number three. You got a walk-in closet. Bring the shelving out so you have more space. Cabinet. Those drawers still have to be put in all over the house. So, so far I've seen three bedrooms. All right. Confused. What is this room? Oh, bonus room. Oh my goodness. So you've got like an office or a, that's a doggy shower. Beautiful. So this one has a doggy shower. You have shelving over here, shelving down there. Really nice. Nice space in here too. So you got three bedrooms and then you've got a utility room that could probably be a playroom, mudroom, office. You've got a doggy shower in here. It's got a transom window up top. And you've got a place to wash the doggy and groom the dog or the baby. It's really up to you. 
really nice. Awesome. I'm like so surprised. And then you have another and it's dark. I'm so sorry. Let me get my phone and see if I can make it lighter. There you go. So you got shower tub combo, toilet and sink. So, so far I've seen three guest bedrooms, two guest bathrooms, and a bonus room. This also has a great room, which is here, or a family room or whatever you wanna call it with a fireplace dining room kitchen living room so let's go see the master I am just blown away right now cool so here's the master have you been on the other side of the house look down there And then this is the master bath. You got double sinks, huge garden tub, your toilet, huge, huge shower, rain shower, shower head. All right. And then master closet. Right, so let me make sure I'm reading this map correctly you guys and giving you the name of the right name of the home okay this is the Hamilton or Delaware it's a 32 oh no no this is Scott built legend I'm so sorry this is the Scott built this is a Scott built home. It's called the legend. It's a four bedroom, three bath with a parlor. So that's called a parlor. All right. It was $1,118. It was $118.9. It's been reduced to $116.9. So this is a Scott built home. I'm sorry. That's why the Hamilton says coming soon. It's not here yet. Scott built four bedroom, three bath, 116.9. All right, hope you enjoy. I don't have to party to have fun, you see. I got different hobbies, and that's all I need. Some say life is boring, but I disagree. I wake up and live my dreams. Be spending it on 